Um, pre has been going great so far. We're really trying to mold in our 11 new players and the 18 returning players. It's been work ethic and uh, work rate have been up, which has been great. With the limited days we have, we're working on trying to do some functional training, get our offense clicking, get our defense set and ready to go. Um, uh, focusing a lot on our tack, our buildup, looking at the areas that we need to improve upon as a team in the last few seasons. And uh, our final third has been a good one, and that's been a high priority for us right now. Preseason's going well. Uh, we came in on Friday and started practicing on Saturday. And um, from what we've seen, it's been one of the, our best preseasons yet. Um, we're really happy with our progress, and um, we look forward to the next four days we have before our first home game. So we're really excited about what we see. Uh, with so many new players, we're really uh, focusing on the, the tactical part of our game. So we're, fo we're focusing on our new formation, making sure all the new players are comfortable in it, and everyone is at the same level playing-wise because we're expecting to sub more this year with less veteran players. Uh, we're putting in a lot of work offensively with the, a lot of new players up there, uh, more of a veteran back. I think we have uh, 11 new players, um, 9 freshmen, um, and this year I think we've um, come off and been more together than we ever have been in the past with the new players. Um, our scrimmage last night I think showed just in two days how far we've come. Uh, so this preseason is going very well. The uh, program motto is a team above all, above all a team. And everything we do reads into our team philosophy is it's what's best for the team. And we have been striving towards that and you know working on perfecting it every single year. We have a great group now and the, return, the uh, alumni who have gone through the program so far have helped kind of set that standard and that tradition and a lot of those are still alive going strong. Every year our seniors pick the motto for the season and this year they picked a quote um, that says, you can pretend to care but you can't pretend to show up. And this comes from a TED Talks video we watched as a team in the spring from Alan Sheen. We call uh, called Because I Said So. And the whole theme behind it is, you know, you can say things, your words, but your actions are going to speak louder. And everything we talked about through so far has kind of led up to that. Uh, during the scrimmage, it um, went really well. It um, actually went a lot better than we, um, you know, ever really thought for our first scrimmage. And we played Corning, and um, we worked on um, our new formation, but also at the same time, um, we worked on um, offensively widening the field and um, also um, defensively when the ball comes back that we're also getting everyone behind the ball and not just um, having our four back defense back there. And from each um, half we approved upon what we talked about. So it was really exciting and it was a great win. Everyone's fitting in really great so far. Um, we, we have nine freshmen and um, they're all fitting in really well. And we have two transfers also that are upperclassmen. Um, but everything's going great. I think um, what will really make a difference is, you know, the mental toughness. We really need to, throughout the season, remain mentally tough. The same mental toughness we have right now during preseason needs to be right in the middle of season when, you know, the weather's changing and we have all these different factors like school and stuff. We just need to remain the intensity that we have now. We've got depth, and I think that's going to be key for us. I think it's going to get us through the entire season, working on the periodization and not hit those slums. We've got great speed and technical ability that we've been able to bring into this class, and being able to you know, change the players up, give some different looks in terms of that. I think it's really going to help when it comes down to the 80th and 90th minute.